alphabet patterns. Today we'll learn about making our own rules to make patterns from alphabets and using these rules to make code language. Chatura, do you know Today, China's Prime Minister will meet our Prime Minister. Yes, I have read it in newspaper. But how will they talk? Why? Because both of them use different languages. They are accompanied by people who can translate the Chinese language into Hindi and Hindi language into Chinese. There are so many languages in the world. English, Russian, Japanese and uh, Punjabi, Kannad, Uriya. Yes, and every language has its own pattern. Patterns in languages too. Hey Bholu, I just remembered we have made a language of our own. And it also has a pattern. How's that? Paw follow pill pig, passport pee fight, poop nose. What are these two talking about? I couldn't even understand a single word. Ha ha! They are talking about you in code language. Ha! Huh. I have never heard this language. They have created this language on their own. And the rule of this language is to replace the initials of each word by P. Why so? Pai Po. Yeah, I got it. Pya, Pai Pot Pit. Absolutely correct. Kids, you can pause the video to translate the words and try to talk in this language. I have understood their language. Pila, pilpu po por pi pite pite. Pass, pack pots. Pike. Now tell me this. What? Vamar si tona yolide. Vamar si tona yolida. What are these two talking about? They are again using code language. But this is different from the first one. Bholu, there is no fixed rule for making patterns. You can use any rule to make new patterns and code. What is the rule for this code? We are speaking each word in reverse order. Kids, you can pause the video and use this rule to speak or write something. Tells the samosas, name with class pet dinner chef. So today we have learned about making our own rules to make patterns from alphabets and using these rules to make code language. Patterns using alphabets. Recognizing alphabet patterns. Kids, today we will learn about recognizing rules of alphabet patterns. Applying the recognized rule to continue the pattern. Come, let's go to music class today. Meet Sarla Madam. She teaches music to Pinku, Rinku, Neeraj, Diya and Chinu. Hello kids, how are you all? Ma'am, I got a sore throat. Oh, this is because of weather change. Do gargle with some warm water. Well, let me take attendance for today. Ma'am, why Neeraj's name is before mine? I was the first one to take admission in your class. 
Can anyone of you tell me why I have put Neeraj's name before Pinku's? I'll tell because Neeraj sings better than Pinku. No, this is not good. You all sing so well. Now think carefully. You have written all the names in alphabetical order. As Pinku's name starts with P and Neeraj's name starts with N. And in alphabets N comes before P. So Neeraj's name is written before Pinku. Very good. Ma'am, our school teacher has also written names in the same order. Writing all names alphabetically is a kind of pattern. So, we can say this is a pattern made of alphabets. Ma'am, are there any more examples of alphabetical patterns? Yes, of course. Let's see. Well, you all know about the seven musical notes, right? Yes, yes. Sare Gama Padhani. These musical notes are also made up of alphabets. Come, let's make some patterns using musical notes today. Before making patterns, one should remember that there is no fixed rule for making patterns. You can make your own rule to make patterns. These are the seven musical notes. Let's make some patterns using this. Can you fill in the blanks? After Rere will come Ga Ga. After Papa will come Dha Dha. Oh wow, you have done it so quickly. Is there any rule in this pattern? Yes, we are repeating each note twice. Come, let us all sing this together. Kids, you can also sing together. Come, let's make a new pattern now. Can we take three notes together? Yes, why not? If we take three notes together like this, Sa, Re, Ga, then what will come after this? Hmm, Re, Ga, Ma. I will say after this, Ga, Ma, Pa. Wow. Ma, Pa, Tha. Wow! Padhani! Very good! So, what is the rule of this pattern? We are leaving the first note and using the corresponding three notes each time. Very good! So kids, today we have learnt about recognizing rules of alphabet patterns and applying the recognized rule to continue the pattern.